Oh, okay, so I I made this video earlier on, and it was a speed code. So today I've taken it upon myself to make um, um an audio for it, um to explain the logic and whatever that goes on. So you have this basic UI which you can see over here. So we have these languages that we are looping through. Okay, and then I have this function to check that language or, or to add it to the um selected languages. Okay, so first of all, we check if that particular language that was selected or was checked is in the selected languages. That means if it is in the selected languages, we are trying to uncheck that um language or that item from the selected items. Okay, so if it is that, we'll, fi we'll filter through those items and then find the ones which are not the same as the um the item picked in this case the language picked okay so if once we are done with that then we return out of the function else that means the item hasn't been checked or it's not available in the um selected languages so we go ahead to check it and then we come here to add our um indicator for checking and then unchecking so over here you can see i'm using the material icons from react native vector icons and this is the check box and this is the unchecked one so we just tie it over here so we check if the um, selected languages include that particular language or uh, at the moment you see like i mentioned before we are looping through those um languages so as we look through them we'll check if that item is in the selected languages over here then we can check it else we would uncheck it so you can save over here and then now you see we have those icons over here. so when i click on it now it's checked so it's on you see so i can check or i can uncheck can uncheck so that's basically it okay so before i go you see people are watching this but are not liking and not subscribing to this please like and subscribe to encourage me to do more Thank you for watching. Bye.